Hey guys, want to talk to you about an all new mobile game called Vikings War of Clans. It's like the top strategy games of the 80s and 90s, but now it's on iOS and Android. I've been all over the world, so many flights in the last month, and I cannot put this thing down. All you have to do is play this game for five minutes to see why everyone is addicted. It's so addictive, it's ridiculous. There's hundreds of strategy games in the App Store, but Vikings stands on an absolutely different level. It's famous for its massive online battles between clans and even countries, with over 3 million players attending these events. If you download the game, with the links in the description below this video, you get 200 gold for a fast and successful start. Once you download the game and get your free 200 gold, hit me up at nickname the Smoking Tire and let's play together. Morning everybody, welcome to Santa Clarita. A little bit of a tight squeeze in here, two big boys, but uh, this is John and thank you for joining us buddy in, uh, in what is now becoming quite a uh, well-known 9-11. It's getting around a little bit. It is, it is. It's a bit of the village bicycle, isn't it? You are a media whore. It's okay. I'm happy to I'm happy to drive this thing and, and tell me tell us all the story of this car because it's quite interesting. Uh yeah. So the story behind the car is that this car I grew up watching my dad race. Uh, as a little kid, four this or five. Car. This, this, this very, car. This car. This exact car. This very car. Not Porsches. This one. This very car. Okay. Car sat in storage for 20 plus years. Wasn't on the road. Someone came by, wanted to buy the car, at which point I said, time out, let's get this back and going. Uh-huh. Uh, had a pretty awesome motor that we had to part out, which we were able to use those funds to finish the car. Uh, we put a 3.2 liter motor in it, put a 915 transmission, redid the entire suspension system. There's no urethane anywhere in the suspension. All Teflon hard mount, oh, spherical man. bearing. Um, Repowder coated all the arms. You know, re gutted the whole interior. So it, it's yeah. A, so it's like a little rough on the surface, but the mechanics of this are actually quite stout, right? Very, very yeah. stout car. Oh, that's cool. So, uh, what year is the car actually? Chassis is a seventy. Okay. Uh, Drivetrain wise, it's from uh, three point two era. Okay, so nine six, like late nine G body into nine six four, like ish, yeah, exactly. Ish. Uh, uh, 80, G, late G 80, body, right? Eighty-seven. Yeah. Okay, cool, awesome. And uh, so there are lap belts only, and but actually the seating position, you being about my size, is is quite comfortable. And I, I'm super excited to have a go. So let's see, uh, let's see what she's about. All right. Yeah. 
perfect, exact perfect gear for this road. Third gear is great in Malibu with this car. Yeah. That's so light on its feet, this thing. I'll try. No, okay. If I double clutch going up, it works. Series. Right. So the wing, the, the fenders, the hood. Is that actually 
pretty neutral, direct. Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't feel unsteady, unsure at the front. A lot of these older cars can feel a little unsure at the front. This one's good. There's yeah, also sticky tires on here and a full tank of gas. Oh yeah, does it? As the tank gets empty, does it get weird? It can get a little like. And we put the big. I'm gonna get made fun of my face every time I go for a third gear ship. Yeah, there it is. It actually takes those bumps pretty good too, doesn't it? Yep. Pretty compliant. Compliance is underrated, my friend. I had a Mini Cooper club in before this. Uh -huh. I feel like this takes the bumps better than the Mini. I'm sure it does. Minis are stiff. Yeah. I had a Mini and it was really stiff. These things just, the, the geometries are right, where it's a fine balance between handling and comfort. But uh, motor aside, how close is this to the setup from when your dad raced it? Uh, fairly close. Really? Yeah. That's very cool. I mean, we updated the dampers, we put adjustable spring plates, a lot easier to adjust right height. But um, other than bushings and whatnot, it's all pretty close to the same. Do you plan to finish the interior at some point, or are you going to leave it the way it is? Uh, in my opinion, it's mostly done, but eventually we'd like to put a roll cage in here. Maybe some door guards? Yeah. Oh boy. Well, I don't know what, what that is about. That's a, I would guess prisoners, if I had to guess. Wrong road. build and drive your dad's race car that's awesome yeah. and the fact it's still in the family so. yeah one owner car right he bought a new second owner car. second owner car well one owner for 50 years well he wrecked the first one which my mom was thrown from oh no broke way. her collarbone no because she got thrown out of the car so this was a replacement oh my god that's crazy that's crazy thanks john that was You're super welcome. fun man i, I appreciate it and, and uh there's a hooniverse video about this car as well there's Where else? else uh and then optima did a two-part video series on it as well oh yeah Perfect. Well, you got you are you are maxing your media coverage. I hope you parlay it into some parts. I try. Something. You should. 
You should. Give him some parts. If you're out there, he, he deserves parts. Well, I've had help from OMP, so that's who helped me oh, out with yeah. seats. Oh, yeah. Seat, this is a good seat. Yeah, this yeah. OMP seat is very comfortable. I've got this OMP steering wheel is nice in my hands. I got some help from Sparco as well. Cool. And my company helped out, so yeah, it's been a fun project. Good, good. Well, good luck with it, and uh, and thank you for letting me uh, have a few minutes with it, because it's great fun. I'm sorry about your third gear. Right. I'm, I can't. I can't be perfect. Apparently, it's, one day it's taking me a while to figure one it out. One day I'm going to learn how to drive a 915 gearbox, possibly. But I guess today's not that day. Thanks for watching. See you later.